Hello everyone, I'm excited to be here with you to discuss a different topic, not taxes today. Instead, we'll focus on practical things you need to know before arriving to France. My name is Giro and I'm a French chartered accountant. Today, we'll guide you through the very first steps to follow once you arrive in France. Let's get started. Visa and residence permit. Before anything else, you need to ensure that you are allowed to stay and perhaps work in France. The rules vary depending on your citizenship. If your stay is less than three months, you won't need anything special. For EU and Swiss citizens, thanks to the EU, you won't need any additional paperwork. For non-EU citizens, it's a bit more complicated. France has different types of visa depending on your situation, such as work, business, tourism, or retirement. We strongly advise you to consult an immigration specialist or explore the French system before proceeding. Important note, some visas allow you to work as an employee, but not as an entrepreneur. Be cautious about the type of visa you're applying for. The French Social Security. Once you arrive in France, you might need to register for the French social security system. This is not automatically granted with your residence permit, so you'll have to apply for it separately. Most French people have a private health insurance called Mutuelle in French, which complements the basic social security coverage. It is usually provided by employers, but you can also obtain your own private insurance from any insurance broker. We highly recommend adding one if you plan to settle in France for an extended period of time. Caution! Registering for social security might have implications on your personal taxes, as you could be required to pay social charges in addition to your income tax. Speaking of taxes, if you intend to live in France for a long time, you will have to declare your taxes here and become a French tax resident. You'll need to submit your first tax return to obtain your tax number along with your first tax bill, added that position, in September. However, you can apply for a tax number in advance using the form 2043. You can check out our video dedicated to French income tax for more information on this topic. Bank accounts. Having a French bank account is not mandatory, but it can be very useful, especially for paid taxes or receiving tax refund. However, having a French bank account does not make you a French tax resident. US citizens might face challenges opening a French bank account due to FATCA law. These laws have led many French banks to refuse them as clients. Don't worry though. Be patient and explore various options, or if you need assistance, feel free to contact us. We can provide you with useful contact to help you navigate this process. Your first French home. Moving to France means finding a place to go home. And depending on your country of origin, this step might be more or less complicated. Fortunately, there are various resources available to make the process smoother. Search online. You can start your search for your dream home on different websites like Le Bon Coin, Sologer, or PAP. This platform lists a wide range of properties available for rent or purchase. Additionally, consider reaching out to real estate agencies for professional assistance and access to exclusive listings. Renting a plate. If you're planning to rent a property, be prepared to provide a file with relevant information about yourself, including your source of income and tax details. Some landlords may also ask for a security deposit, and in some cases, a go rentor might be required to secure the rental agreement. Buying a place. If you're looking to buy a property, keep in mind that you'll need to budget for additional costs. Approximately 7 to 8% of the purchase price would go towards natural fee. To ensure a smooth transaction, consider having your own entry to guide you through the legal aspects of the process. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you found this video helpful and informative as you embark on your journey of setting up in France. 
If you enjoy this content and want to stay up to date with all of the latest tips, advices and insights about living and thriving in France, consider subscribing to the channel. By subscribing, you will never miss out on our future videos that would help you navigate the ins and outs of life in our beautiful country. Thank you very much.